Free Game segment. Free Game by Pierre-Luc Rioux. Uh, free Game. Okay, something... There's an advice that uh, somebody gave me earlier on that completely changed my outlook on music and on making a living doing music. And he was a, a business person and he was not in the business of music, but he said, I looked at music and I realized one thing, and the people that uh, emancipate from just the daily grind and that becomes successful in uh, you know modern terms, depending on what your de definition of success is, are content creators. And I wouldn't say that I've transitioned from session player to producer. I think I'm both because uh, I still do sessions. Oh, yes, please. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, yes, you still do sessions. <laughs> I do a bunch. Yes, you, that, the new Justin Bieber album, go, go check it out. Uh, yeah, he's on that. <laughs> uh, but when I heard that, I'm like, okay, great. So I have to move from doing sessions, not owning uh, the copyright or the master recording or whatever, to being a content creator. And the, the thing that's amazing about the internet today is that you can accelerate your content for zero marginal cost. You know, you Ooh. can uh, do one MP3 or 10 million MP3s for the same marginal cost, which is zero. Um, so become a content creator, own something of that, that you make, even if it's a small portion. Uh, so first advice, being a content creator. Second advice, I would say specialize. So from my personal experience, I specialized in guitar playing. I became really obsessed with it. And then I got this opportunity. I was working at this label, and I, I thought, this artist needs another record, another French record. I'm going to make it. I went to them and said, she needs another record. I'm going to make it. They said, you can do that? I said, yeah. And <laughs> I didn't even know what an EQ was. Uh, <laughs> but uh, and, and, uh, and I couldn't technically do it, but I, I, I jumped in the pool and I did it. And I think advice to young women out there, there is a, a difference in the, whatever, from what I've read, in the science between male and female on risk-taking. Uh, some men, m more men than women, claim to take jobs that they're not qualified for. Uh, wow. Sheryl Sandberg wrote a book about it called Leaning In. Uh, or lean in, whatever. Mm -hmm. uh, so, as 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 a you know young man, uh, somebody said you can do that. I said yes. It it's apparent that young women would have said, uh, according to the data, I'm not saying that. Uh, would have said, uh, I don't think I'm qualified for that. So I would give it the advice to young women to take jobs that you're not qualified for, and learn on the on the job and and do it i think there's not enough female producers and uh uh yeah female producers especially i'm going to stop at that i think there's not enough female a bunch of other things but in music uh but producers there's very few and there's the ones that i know are amazing amazing so it's not for lack of talent uh and i Maybe it's for, 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 for not jumping in the pool when, um, even if you're not qualified. So take, take, take the leap, even if, uh, when it's most scary to jump, that is when you jump. Oh my God.